I'm Storm Tracker 16 meteorologist Ali Gallo with an update on tonight's winter storm after a quiet first half of our Sunday, quiet all day long. We are now starting to see some of that snow moving in here in the music area here in our backyard. We've just started to see some of our first flakes falling. So now we will be dealing with times of snow and rain tonight and overnight into early tomorrow morning, which will likely impact our morning commute. So I want to just give an update with the weather. Winter weather advisories are now in effect all across northeastern and central Pennsylvania. So we are seeing all the areas shaded in purple. Again, that winter weather advisory in central Pennsylvania, that goes until six o'clock tomorrow morning, farther east in eastern Pennsylvania. That's go going to go until one o'clock tomorrow afternoon. So this storm actually tapers off from west to east. So again, the morning commute will be impacted. Definitely expect some delays tomorrow morning as the system pulls away. But we do see that change over back to snow before that happens. So here it is on satellite and radar again after a dry all day long morning and early afternoon. Now we are seeing that precipitation moving in. So everything right now is on the lighter side. We're seeing uh, some of that light snow in central Pennsylvania, central Pennsylvania, parts of Clinton and like Cumming County, the northern parts of both of those counties now just getting ready to move east into the Tawanda area. So the western part of Bradford County seeing some of that snow starting to fall. But that's really about it. Farther east, everything that we're seeing is very, very light. So again, we've had a few flakes here in our backyard in and around Mount Pocono, seeing some, some of that light snow in Carbon County, Jim Thorpe, Lee Heighton, seeing a bit of a mix of that snow and rain. So again, within the next couple of hours, we continue to see that precipitation filtering in. And then overnight tonight, that change over to mainly plain rain. So timing it out, future clouds and radar Again, a couple of hours of snow, especially in central Pennsylvania. So by six, seven, eight o'clock, we are starting to see that precipitation continuing to move east. So a lot of us, most of us across northeastern and central Pennsylvania seeing at least some form of precipitation, either that snow or a little bit of that mix. But then by tonight, 10, 11 o'clock tonight uh, into midnight, we see that change over to plain rain and it is going to rain for a couple of hours overnight tonight. And then you can see that snow filtering back in from the west. So by the morning commute, first thing tomorrow morning, we are seeing that snow in central Pennsylvania. That changeover happening farther east as the morning goes on. So again, that winter weather advisory in effect until six o'clock tomorrow morning in central Pennsylvania. It goes longer farther east to one o'clock tomorrow afternoon. So by seven o'clock tomorrow morning, we are seeing again still some of that steadier snow before tapering off from west to east to just lingering snow showers. So the system pulls away by late morning, early afternoon, but definitely expect some delays first thing tomorrow morning before it does pull away. As far as snowfall totals go, still thinking a general one to three inches for most of us, you can see especially farther south, but across our northern tier, highest elevations, that's where that higher range of three to six inches, again, where that changeover to rain takes a little bit longer. And then when that changeover to snow, back to snow tomorrow morning happens, I think we'll be picking up just, uh, again, some, some of those sn higher snowfall totals, closer to that six inch in that range for those highest elevations across our northern tier. So just recapping what we can expect, again, tonight, some, a couple of hours of snow before that change over to rain overnight, back to snow tomorrow morning. So expect those delays early tomorrow morning. And then as the system pulls away tomorrow afternoon, we'll have some lingering snow showers around. It will be a bit of a brisk day tomorrow as well. Quiet on Tuesday before our next storm brings another round of a mix of rain and snow come Wednesday. So temperatures right now in the 30s all across the area, but keep in mind those highest elevations. So places like Blakesley, Hazleton, Sarah, all seeing that 32 degrees. 37 now in Scranton, 37 in Williamsport as well. It's 36 currently in Bloomsburg. So temperatures tonight will hold steady, dropping a couple of degrees overnight tonight, then starting to rise towards tomorrow morning. And then there's a look at your forecast for your Monday. Again, kind of holding steady right in the low to mid thirties for those temperatures. So snow in the morning, that steadier snow in the morning becoming, becoming more scattered snow showers by the afternoon. The rest of tomorrow is cloudy, a bit brisk. We'll have a, a wind that shifts out in the Northwest. So it's going to average up to about 10 to 15 miles an hour by tomorrow afternoon. So a bit of a brisk day tomorrow. Again, that steadier snow in the morning, but cloudy through the rest of the day. So here's the seven day forecast. 30s tomorrow with those lingering snow showers around. Tuesday is quiet before our next 
Storm brings us another chance for snow, mixing with and changing back over to rain Wednesday and into Thursday. So just a reminder that winter weather advisory now in effect for all of Northeastern and Central Pennsylvania. Central Pennsylvania, farther west, we see that until six o'clock tomorrow morning, farther east until one o'clock tomorrow afternoon. And I'll have your full forecast on Newswatch 16 at 